So I had to go shopping today and I had to buy something I haven't bought in probably almost two years. Trash bags. The last time I bought trash bags, I was in Camden, Tennessee for a class and it came a rainstorm and I had to go to the Walmart in Camden and get these and a, and a huge, 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 I think it was a 20 pound bag of rice to put my computer in to dry it out and I hardly ever have to take my trash out because most of what I have is, um, it, I just burn it in my yard and holes to fill the holes up and I only have to take down when I have cans, things like that. So these bags last me for a long time. Can you read that? What's written on the can? On the can? Empty me when I am full. I wrote that for my sons when they live with me because having trash come to the top of the liner apparently was not an indication that the trash needed to be taken out. But that's another story. I'll, I'll look at what they had at the grocery store and they have trash bags that come in all different kinds of scents now. They smell like gain, they smell like citrus, they smell like mint, which is what this one is. They have odor eaters, they have all kinds of things that smell good and the, uh, they have all kinds of things that uh, smell good for trash bags. These smell pretty good, so I was thinking, what do I want to smell in my kitchen? for probably the next two years because this is probably how long this is going to last me. I thought mint. And also it says rodent repellent since I hardly ever take my trash out and we have had a possum crawl in the garbage can before but that was before we had a lid on it. I don't know. I'll try the mint but whatever it is I'm kind of married to it for two years now. So these are Great Value Tall Kitchen Bags. They're supposed to be rodent repellent with a mint scent that's effective against the Norway rat and raccoons. I'm not sure I have a problem with those, but apparently I won't now. There are 44 bags in here. I think this was $7.98. There's 13, these are 13 gallon tall drawstring bags. And there's the size of them. They are assembled in the United States of America, factory certified, whatever that means. We're supposed this is supposed to reduce Norway rats and raccoons from damaging garbage bags when left outdoors. When used indoors or used as a typical household trash bag. Okay, I don't even I just got it because it's because of the mint smell. It's sounding better to me than citrus or lavender or gain or whatever. Don't try to wear plastic bags. Again, this has the Walmart satisfaction guaranteed. Don't put food in them. There's Walmart information. I got these in March of 2018 and I paid $6.98 for them. Let's see what they look like. Oh, I have a little green twist of ties. Oh, they're advertising themselves on there. They do smell great. Smells like a pack of gum. Hmm. Active ingredients. Well, smells good. Okay, I'm gonna try these and see how they do. Clearly, they want you to advertise their brand while you're carrying your trash bags to wherever you carry your trash bags. Honestly, I've never seen that before, but it might make sense in some situations. That's a lot of advertising on a trash bag, isn't it? I would think that maybe one in the middle or closer to the bottom might be enough, but hey, you do you, Great Value. It does smell good. It has a really clean, minty smell. We'll see how long it lasts. It's also pretty thick. I've had some problems with Great Value coffee filters being too thin. In fact, today it made a huge mess when I made coffee. It just let all the coffee go through. Even though I'm using two Great Value filters, I really do not want a Hubble punctured in my trash bags and having what's in there spill all over everything. So they feel pretty thick. I honestly don't use that many trash bags. This 
uh, it's a trash bag I bought a couple of years ago, actually in Camden, Tennessee at Walmart, and I have to look up the brand, but it's much thinner than this is. This feels a whole lot more solid. And I, since I bought them a long time ago, I don't remember what the brand is. Let's see if it tells down here. Nope, just tells you not to use it as a toy, I guess. Yeah, don't, don't let your children play with trash bags. I've been using these bags for quite a while now, and I like them. They still smell good. I bought them actually mm, about eight months ago. They're plenty thick enough. I haven't had a single puncture, a single leak. They do make the, the rim smell good for a couple of days if you take your trash out every day. You know, you have that fresh scent. I have a smaller trash can so they fit quite nicely in there. So overall, I'm very happy with these great value tall kitchen bags with the rodent repellent. I haven't had any bugs or anything in them. And I still have a lot left. Cleanliness is next to godliness, if that means anything to you. Thanks for watching my review of the great value tall kitchen bags that are rodent repellent in them and smell like mint. If you have another brand that you suggest for us to use or another scent, Leave it in the comments below. Remember, that's so attractive, isn't it? Tell us the things that we need to use and the things that we need to avoid so that we can become better consumers and help each other out. Till next time, bye. If you have time, watch a video.